Kempel Combatives. Today I'm going to demonstrate combination three, the Shaolin Kempel version and the Kempel Combatives alteration. So if Mark throws a straight shot at me in Shaolin Kempel, combination three is a parry and a shot into the short ribs at the same time. Then I'm just going to slap his arm down, roll up, and back fist them in the temple or the jaw. It's one of the more street effective moves that Shaolin Kempo has. It doesn't require a whole lot of edits, but there's a couple of things that kind of irk the OCD in me, and that's what I've made the changes for. So the first shot, I didn't change anything. That's, that's excellent. Just get that out of the way. I'm just gonna kind of turtle up over here and start firing a counter strike right into his floating ribs. If I'm really good, I'll get his liver, and that's the end of the, that's the, end of the altercation right there. Instead of just making this a passive slap, I'm actually gonna strike right here with either a hammer fist or a knife hand going straight down to get that arm out of the way and start impacting him. I don't ever want to just move, and anytime I actually make a move on his body, I want it to be aggressive. I want to be, have, make it have value. So I'm actually going to hit that down. And this back fist I've never liked, because if I miss and I'm off target perfectly with these knuckles, I'm exposing all the little bones in the back of the hand right here, all the little metacarpals, and those are gonna, if I hit his skull with those, I've got broken buckles at this point. So I'm a big advocate of turning this into a hammer fist as it goes by, or if I'm very close, I could even make that an elbow, throw him off, and I'm gone. So it looks exact, almost exactly the same in midair, but the alteration, and that's pretty much my interpretation of how you can take a Shaolin Kempo technique and make it street effective.